just inside our our own Milky Way galaxy, experts now believe are some 400 billion stars, but this number may seem small as some astrophysicists. <laughs> did you just make up a name? I did. Astrophys- Lord astrophysicist. Physicist. <laughs> Come over here and give me a physicist, you old big words with, Big words with whiskey here Is now. that a, an astrophysicist, did you say? <laughs> Physicer, physicer, I don't know. Phys- physicist. Uh, some astrophysicists believe that stars in our galaxy could f- could figure the trillion. I think there's a misprint there in the trillion, maybe. Uh, this means the Milky Way on, uh, alone could be home to more than 100 billion planets. Now, not all of those are habitable, of course, but, you know, uh, we haven't even really reached we we've hardly reached any planets you know they're they're searching for planets at their and our nearest stars now is this a conclusion or a hypothesis no that well you know, I, once again i personally don't believe there's ever a conclusion when it comes okay. to, to things well, like this is space force actually already visiting these worlds and we just don't know about it just yet I mean, the Stargate yeah, under Cheyenne Mountain is—they've—they've they've kept Stargate a secret for a long time. Ooh. We gotta send out a special hello to one uh, TJ. She's watching. Say hi Fuck to TJ. my friend Heather too. She's Kirk watching. Kirk Stacy Joel. Hey Jessica. Oh, hello Heather. Hope hey, you guys Heather. are doing well. And Heather, what's Heather. up? Heather, you met Heather a couple times. Oh, oh yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. You met her last time you were here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, yeah, yeah. What's up? Um, however, since astronomers aren't able to see our galaxy from the outside, they can't really know for sure the number of planets the Milky Way is home to. Uh, they believe our galaxy is home to at least 400 billion stars, but I mentioned above this number could drastically rise. Well, okay, fine. <laughs> it's so Rocky Stewart, she loved the new word you just invented. <laughs> Astrophysics. I don't even know what I said now. Astro- <laughs> yeah, it was a name. <laughs> you know what? We, so, look, we were just talking about Rocky Stucci's show earlier. Uh-huh. Props. We need to get Rocky back on the show. You know what I'm saying? What's yeah, up, we got to get, get him in here for a, for an interview. We do. Yeah, we, gotta, we do. Um, with him. <laughs> yeah, because it's always fun. It's always a good time. You know, six months to you. Pew, pew, shoot the shit. <laughs> pew, pew. Um, <laughs> it would be interesting to Google, though. Um, the stars in our sky, the number of stars in our sky compared to the number of trees on Earth. What do you think is higher? Ooh, I'm, oh, wow. I'm still guessing stars in the sky. I don't know. I got to Google it. <laughs> <laughs> really? But I, I, I don't know that Google's going to have the answer. They didn't know what five with 22 zeros is. I, I punched that into Google and Google went, Huh? 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 All right, all right, hold on. Like, so like Scoob, right. Let's go get a Scooby snack. <laughs> hey, Scoob. Sorry. Um, so, uh, yes, there are more trees on Earth than the stars that you can physically see. Oh, physically. You physically see. Can in physically oh, yeah. see in the that I believe. Yes. Yes. yes, but here's a question: Can you physically see every tree on Earth without moving? What? No, no, absolutely. Not. Right, you that's can't my see point. Every star in the sky without moving. That's my point. Actually, I could. I totally could. I just need everybody else to go take pictures of them, and I will stay in one place <laughs> no. and look at it. I yeah. Uh, <laughs> what about Photoshop, Chris? What's up? So they might any trick you, me. Uh, well, I'm going to ask you, Rusty. But I mean, does could any of you, yeah. when you look up at at the stars in the sky, can you trace other than the Big Dipper, Little Dipper, stuff like that? Can you Whoa. trace out like the astrological signs? No, no, I can't. But can I, I, how big is this Dipper, by the way? Well, other than Orion, it is so big. <laughs> but uh, yeah, you know, if if you go out and you stay long enough and let your eyes adjust, if you're in a good, you can actually see some satellites moving across uh, the sky right i will ask i will i will say that it, uh if you go out to the desert like when i lived in arizona i mean it's when you go out away from society 
civilization. Like it's possible to do that because there's not all the trees and you can really, this is why there are so many observatories in the West because there's, there's not as much, you know, uh, infiltration of light, right. From the cities and everything, man, just in my backyard alone, in the town I lived in, they actually want you to not have any big lights at night. They want you to face them down. So it does because of observatories. And there are a lot of people who live in the area who have their own telescopes at home. You know, we're talking not just something, you know, binocular stuff and, and whatever. I, I don't know. They're, they're, they're very technical, personally owned telescopes and people are star watchers, stargazers, if you will. Um, but you can see with your naked eye, even so much more, so many more stars. It's vast. It's amazing. You can see the, like the band from the Milky way at night. Sometimes it's beautiful. Yep. It's gorgeous. Yep. Um, so what do you all think is what are the, dang it, where'd it go? What are the top six foods? Uh, that will make you. Whoa. Rusty, you should probably check your shorts. Uh, soy sauce, if you taste it with your nuts, will make you fart for sure. <laughs> <laughs> Look, if you can taste soy sauce with your nuts, you're talented. You deserve a come spot on. on something. So. But she can taste soy Oh, g- come on. Y'all, give me, give me some. Let's. Beans. Chris, give me beans. top three, six uh, food. Beans, uh, beans one. cabbage. Yep. Uh, cheesecake. Grapes. Oh, cheesecake. <laughs> just cheese and hey, cheddar. Hold on. Back up. Did Did you really just say cheesecake? Right, we'll, we'll give you cheese. They're, they're listing Cheesecake milk. was kind milk. of a, a smart-ass answer. We'll, we'll, is beer a food? Yes, beer is a food. Beer is definitely a food. All right. So they have it listed here. The top six foods that make you fart are beans, <laughs> corn, well, would you say porn? What does porn have porn. to do with making you fart? <laughs> I thought bell, you said porn. Yeah. Bell peppers, cauliflower, cabbage, and milk. So if you were to Very put rough. all that in a crock pot, <laughs> in an instant pot, and cook it all up. Actually, that's good. I I know, right? Uh, Some mirepoix. Look, <laughs> beep, I'm saying if, if you will scramble up some eggs and fry a piece of bologna. And put it on a sandwich and eat that sandwich. Oh my Ooh, God! Shit. The gas that it makes. Oh shit! Really? I'm just saying. With Did you a say a, a bologna my... sandwich? Oh yeah. Uh, uh, TJ says broccoli. Broccoli. Well, well, cauliflower, broccoli. Well, I think they're in the same family. Yeah. Are they? Yeah, I think they are. I'm pretty I, sure I they're. Really yeah, the, the cauliflower are white supremacists, and the broccoli are the. Oh no, oh no, no! Cauliflower is privileged, Chris. Privileged, yes. And the the yeah. green, the broccoli, then that's like Martian trees. Mm, like the white green beans. Wait, They're what? Frozen. White green? Wait, what? White green beans? You've never seen white green beans? Oh, I'm still not clear on how porn bean? gives you gas, though. <laughs> 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 well, well, Rusty, you know how when, um, like, the, the webcam porn, right? You know how that works? Wait, what? Uh, no, no, I have no idea how that works. But go <laughs> I don't believe you, Rusty. I don't. <laughs> but anyway. You sit on a throne of lies. <laughs> Some people may lie. say you... You are a liar. <laughs> All right. So moving forward, please. What about it? What about what? Webcam porn. What? <laughs> That's the only thing I said Web- that piqued your interest. Cor- oh, corn no, hub. I forgot. Keep moving. Rusty's watching Corn Hub all day. Corn Hub. <laughs> Bunch of Native Americans. Peach, peaches and cream. Corn Hub. <laughs> oh, my gosh. <sighs> And for the latest and greatest, it's Popcorn Hub. Popcorn. Yeah. Woo. Oh. Stick around, it gets hot. That was. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh popular. Oh, my God. I think we're 
were doing good there for a while, and then we took a dumpster fire trip. <laughs> Don't we always? <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> That's what our listeners like. You know, dumpster one guy fire! at least. 